Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel journey my Junkins revealed the sex of her baby first baby and the real assuring that her child Monaco is a baby girl the co-host shares her baby with husband Jeezy that's the part that I'm still just so overwhelmed with my says of becoming a girl mom in a preview clip for the Wednesday episode I can't explain to you how many visions jump into my head this moment, I put that little girl into my hands. I thought about my relationship with Mama Mai that already I can't wait to have the bond with Monaco. She adds, I also thought about all the things that I didn't learn as a little girl that I can't wait to teach my daughter now. There's just so many reasons why raising a little girl is such an honor to me. I would have been happy with anything but to have Monaco, I can tell you, I feel chosen. It's emotional. And I can't wait to raise a really strong, loving, empathic, humorous, fashionable, fly little girl. On January 11, my Junkins announced the exciting news of baby Monaco's arrival on Instagram with a sweet snap of a baby blanket cover and footprints with a name tag baby Junkins nearby. Baby Junkins is here, she added. In a video on her Hello Honey YouTube channel earlier this month, my Junkins gave a tour of baby Monaco's neutral colored nursery and explained that the sweet meaning behind the little ones wanting her i thought baby jay's name should be a j name because obviously Janie and jay-z makes sense but that wasn't the name that came to us my jenkins explained what really came to us was how baby jay came to fruition for us we, when we were dating she recalled a pivotal trip to monaco France and she and Jay-Z took the ring which they discussed their goals for the future and established what was going on for us. That's really the theme for the nurse of the nursery, what Monaco is about. Family movements, traveling, discussions, important key points in my life and Jesus' life that brought Monaco here, she added. On Monday, my Jenkins shared a cat Instagram post in which she opened up about her first few weeks as a mom, sharing that the fourth trimester has been the harder trimester yet. While being a new mom is the most exhilarating moment I have ever experienced in my life. Nothing prepared me for the postpartum. Nothing, no book I've read, advice I've gotten that could have compiled all the things I would need. Just to sit, lay down, walk, or even hold our baby, she captioned the photo of her sitting in a pair of Friday mom briefs and holding a baby bottle. She added the full trimester has been the hardest trimester yet, but I'm happy healing mom over her hair postpartum. What are your thoughts? So tell us in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share comments, and most importantly, turn your notifications on. Thanks for watching.